Hello and welcome to the 7 o'clock news from Bahrain International. I'm Sarah Lebrek. A phone call was held between His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa and the custodian of the two holy mosques, King Salman bin Abdulaziz Al Saud. The two leaders reviewed bilateral relations binding the two countries in addition to regional and international developments. The representative of His Majesty the King for Charity Works and Youth Affairs, Chairman of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sports, and President of Bahrain Olympic Committee, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, won first prize in the first Bahrain Triathlon Championship. The championship was hosted in Durrat Marina under the supervision of the Bahrain Triathlon Association. It was organized by Bahrain Roadrunners Club and the organizing committee of the Ironman Championship in Bahrain, in cooperation with the Valiat Company. The championship included a 1,900-meter swimming course, a 40-kilometer cycling course, and a 10-kilometer cycling course. Over 200 Bahraini informed participants took part in the championship to test their readiness before entering the Bahraini International Ironman Championship. A number of world champions will take part in the event, which will be hosted on the 10th of December 2016. His Highness Sheikh Nasser affirmed that uh, this championship counts as a second phase trial, which is an excellent opportunity for athletes to test their technical and uh, physical fitness. He stated that the championship has shown a high readiness level in light of the figures achieved. His Highness added that the Bahrain Triathlon Championship, would, which will be hosted next December, will be very competitive because of the participation of world champions. He stressed that uh, he aims to achieve new records in the championship and he commended its general organization. At the end of the race, Sheikh Nasser was crowned first place as well as other participants who have achieved first places in different categories. The corporate, spo the corporate sponsors and collaborators were also honored by the chairman of the Bahrain Triathlon Association, Sheikh Sagar bin Salman Al Khalifa. Sheikh Nasser also honored Bahrain Triathlon Association's champions who have achieved remarkable results in the West Asia Championship, which was hosted in Jordan. Under the patronage of the representative of His Majesty the King for Charity Work and Youth Affairs, President of the Supreme Council for Youth and Sport, Head of Bahrain's Olympic Committee, the Honorary President of the Royal Equestrian and Endurance Federation, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, the endurance race uh, will kick off tomorrow for a distance of 120 kilometers and qualifying 80 and 40 kilometers. Riders uh, from the kingdom representing various stables will participate in the race. The race is considered the first of the Royal Equestrian and Endurance Federation races approved by Sheikh Nasser by the President of the Royal Equestrian and Endurance Federation, Sheikh Faisal bin Rashid Al Khalifa. His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad followed up on the horse's vet tests, uh, whereby the affirmation on ensuring success for the current season and providing all the necessary support for the riders for the purpose of projecting the best image of Bahrain's endurance sport. This is in addition to preserving the accomplishments made by the riders during the past sporting events. Sheikh Nasser lauded the organizing procedures that have taken place for the purpose of preparing for the race. He expressed confidence in the members of the royal team who will take part in the race based on the experiences they have gained in various events. He added that uh, they had uh, or the team has always been a strong competitor and that he is confident that they will achieve advanced positions. Sheikh Nasser commended the local stables horse riders for their efforts in preparing their horses for the current season. For his part, Sheikh Faisal stated that the Federation is ready to organize the race in a way to guarantee its success. He also noted that the Federation's committee have worked hard to prepare early for the race. In the presence of the Vice President of the High Committee of uh, Rash Equestrian and Horse Racing Club, His Highness Sheikh Isa bin Salman bin Hamad, the fourth race of the season was hosted in uh, Rafah area in Sakhir. The race uh, was attended by a number of the royal family members, race sponsors, and a big audience. Sheikh Isa presented the late uh, Hassan bin Salah Arwai trophy to the race winner, Jafar Murzoug. The chairman of the uh, Ali Finch company, Ali Hassan, presented the company's trophy to His Highness Sheikh Salman bin Mohammed bin Isa Al Khalifa.